just cut that short and get started, boys and girls. Welcome, welcome. Happy Saturday. We've had a good week so far. Had a busy day with four college matches yesterday. It was uh, JUCO. Two of them uh, that played against each other were in the uh, top 25 of all uh, Division One JUCO schools. So that was fun. It's a tight spot. How are you? So I am off all day today and tomorrow. I got a ref Monday through Thursday next week. So a little over two weeks to go uh, in my ref season for the fall. So try and get this regular season over as quick as we can. We're going to play the month of June today. And uh, we'll come back with some uh, night streams next week. Um, I'll probably wait until Wednesday because I ref during the day, weird middle of the day at a college <laughs> matches at 12. So I will, I will be refing uh, Wednesday night and then uh, come back maybe Friday or Saturday. But uh, we're going to be moving to mostly night streams after this. Um, so I want to get this season over with, see if we can get, uh, Back to the World Series and finally win one. If you guys weren't around for the uh, off season on the first two episodes, we picked up Mike Trout in the off season, trying to get him a World Series before he retires. We also traded for Royce Lewis and signed Joan Duran as our closer. And those are our big three moves. So um, we are thirty-eight and eighteen. Have the best record in baseball. We have the most runs scored in baseball. Um, so, uh, stat wise, Jordan Walker's crushing it at 322 with 10 and 48. Naylor, 347 with 10 and 39. Mike Trout, 300 with 15 and 30. Gorman, down to 234, but he's got 15 and 33. Mason Wins had a couple of clutch home runs. So, pitching wise, your A's are right around four outside of Cutliff. Bullpen's been much better than starting staff. So, anyway. Look at our schedule. Um, the All-Star break is uh, like a week later than normal. So um, we're going to get through the entire month of June. Uh, we're not having a lot of uh, focus on the draft because this is our last season, so the draft is irrelevant. Um, I'll still, you know, scout players and everything, but I'm not going to uh, go out of my way to try and get the best draft class. That's uh, not the emphasis. Um but anyway, here we go. Um, let me look at this. Baltimore and the Cubs are the only ones in the division. Let me go look at... So Baltimore is 32 and 24, so they have a winning record. Padres do not. Look at the Padres and the White Sox are about the same. Cubs under 500. Dodgers only three games over. Toronto is 20 games under. Miami's over. So I tell you what. We're only going to play two games and I'll send the rest. Um, we're going to play at Wrigley, um, and then we're going to play a home game, probably not against Milwaukee because we're crushing the division. Uh, we're probably going to play the Blue Jays at home. So, White Sox, I'm sorry, Cubs. Cubs and Blue Jays are, are uh, full games. The rest are all sim, maybe some player locks in there, but that's what we're going to do, so... Nick Lodolo has moved on to Baltimore, so let's let's do a player lock here. And uh, you know what? I'm going to do this a lot. Well, you know what? I'm going to do Mason Wynn this game. Let's do Mason Wynn. You're going to see a lot of Trout because it's uh, our only shot to uh, show him in a franchise right now. So um, we are going to... Uh, Try to show him as much as possible as a as a cardinal player. Turn this up. I did turn off the play-by-play, uh, -play, so we don't have to worry about Shambi and Singleton. So, all right, Lodolo, what are you doing? You're three and three with a 352. Not bad. All right, Naylor already has an RBI, so we got one on and two out here in the first. I can't believe the number of 
uh, girls from Brazil that I saw playing Juco volleyball in the United States yesterday. There was at least four teams, and I bet you there was at least... There's probably close to 10 girls from Brazil playing for these four teams. It was amazing. There's another girl from... from not Colombia. Um, there's another one from Dominican. There was a girl from... Darn a blank. It's another Central American country. It was amazing the amount of girls <laughs> that will come from out of the country to go play junior college volleyball in the Midwest in Iowa and Missouri and Kansas. It's amazing. There we go, Mason. Get down, get down, get down. Oh, what a catch. I thought that was going to get down and maybe skip by him. What a play. As a, another proof for the uh, spreadsheet of the uh, CPU playing diamond level defense, and uh, we can't even field a simple ground ball sometimes. So, all right. Two to one after solo home runs by the Orioles. But it's awesome. Pretty high level volleyball yesterday. It was fun. Long day. I had to drive over an hour out of town through these winding uh, country roads, two lane highways. I tried to check it. Ah, that just would not stop breaking in my hands. Yeah, I haven't been paid yet. But I will. I have one school tight spot that owes me $700. Told me it was going to be in my account Thursday or Friday. I still don't have it. So I'm going to contact my assigner and say, Hey, they owe me $700. bucks. i am not doing another match at that school till they pay me my fucking money. I'm not working for free, man. <laughs> pay me my damn money. Sometimes they'll wait. They'll make you wait till like the first week of the next month. So they'll pay for a whole month worth of matches at one time, and that's fine. But it, it's been over a month since I ref there, so I want my damn money. Oh. I think I have a total of 1,500 outstanding. That's 700 from one school. There we go. All right. We are the tying run, so hopefully we can get a hit here. Make it a one-run game and get ourselves on base. Unless I want to poke this over the wall. Ah, Well, that's going to get us a run, but it's not going to get anybody on base. So now we're going to have to hit a spill a homer to tie the game. And it's going to sim, and we lose. That's too bad. I had a chance earlier in the game to drive in a run, and I missed it. Two hits for Trout and Naylor. Not much for the rest of the team. Cutliff pitched okay. Took the loss. Difference was they hit uh, two solo homers. You will never see me do a franchise for the Orioles or the Twins. Because I hate how they bastardized the ballpark at Camden Yards by moving left field so far out that it... Takes a perfect, perfect to hit a home run to straightaway left field. Such garbage. Um, and you won't see me play with Minnesota because there's center field batter's eye. In the game, it's damn near impossible to see the ball during the day because of the glare coming off the uh, the uh, ivy. It's the weirdest thing. And San Diego refuses to do something about it. You literally can't see the ball until it's right up on you. All right, let's sim that game. We lose five to nothing. It's not a good start. Ivy got pounded. Santander with a home run. Kyle Bradish with a shutout. Go check out the scouting real quick. All right, so that catcher is nothing special. Picking 29th. Let's try. This right fielder. That's week nine. It's week ten. All right, we'll stay there. 
And we'll just sim that game. And we bounce back, win 6-2. to two. No home runs. Painter pitched really well, though. Be Josiah Gray. All right, 39 and 20. Save this. Finally got to watch Mizzou play. The last couple of games or so, they've they've uh, been playing while I've been refing college matches. So I got to watch them play in front of nobody at UMass and pound the shit out of the Minutemen. Unfortunately, Brady Cook is still a fucking terrible quarterback, and he threw a hospital ball to uh, Lewis Burden on a on a slant and an RPO and threw it too high, made him take a shot to the shoulder, and he had to leave the game. So. Brady Cook proving again that he's a fucking idiot and a bad quarterback. That's why Mizzou's being held back. We did sign a five-star quarterback, so next year we should have somebody that's competent. <laughs> but we're going to lose Burden. He's going to be uh, in the in the draft to be a first-round pick. All right. Henson Lesko. Lesko's right-handed, right? I believe he is. I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he's right-handed. All right. So now let's... Let's do a player lock here. And uh, let's do Nolan. Nolan, Nolan, Nolan. So I decided to hop on 3.30ish to try and get this done in three hours or less so I can watch the Ducks hopefully beat the shit out of Ohio State. Fuck the Ohio State. Bama should have lost today, too. I'm actually glad Bama didn't lose because I want them to have one loss when Mizzou plays. So if we somehow have our quarterbacks show up and play properly, we might be able to uh, get a win on the road, but I'm going to count on it. There we go. Nice rocket up the middle. Saw Naylor hit a two-run homer to get this game started. <clears throat> Texas, Oklahoma, that game's going to be over by half. I know Oklahoma has a pretty good defense, but their top five wide receivers are out. So I would expect Texas to win that game by three touchdowns or more. <clears throat> Seven to three. Oklahoma's that game's already over because Oklahoma's gonna have a lot of trouble scoring unless they score on defense. And I would expect Texas to leave Ewers in the whole game, no matter what the score is. Try and get him back to his normal playing style after missing a bunch of weeks, right? Get him some live game reps. Unless it's like, you know, fifty to three, then of course. But I can't stand Oklahoma. Don't really like Texas either. <laughs> Don't tell Revamp. That's his boys. No, he knows. I Texas, Oklahoma, that's Revamp against uh Sir Panda. <laughs> Gotta root for my boy Revamp in that situation. Oh, I tried to hold up. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I couldn't get my hands in far enough. Oh, and he boots it. And we are going to be out. It's not bad. All right, 5 nothing in the 8th. There we go. Mason win, two-run homer. Told you he's got some clutch home runs. Poor Mr. Hurricane badly mismanaged him. That's nah, double play. Just stay away from the low ones. Need that ball up in the upper half. All right, no, doesn't matter. We get the shutout. Yeah, five nothing. Win and Naylor with home runs, and Tink goes eight and a third, nine strikeouts. He's six and one. There we go. There we go, Tink.
All right, 40 and 20 is our record. Anybody else have 40 wins? No, we're the only one with 40 wins. And then Manoa loses a 2-1 to one game. Good start by Musgrove. Makes a win, or only run with a home run. And we bounce back, win the series. Tatis with a home run. Bunch of doubles. One, two, four, five, six doubles and two triples. No home runs. Cutliff pitched all right. Bullpen did their job. Nine to four win. Um, it's Gyro. Is he lefty or righty? I don't know. I know he's a prospect. I just don't know if he throws lefty or righty. He throws right. Okay. Let us play our lock. with Trout. Oh, man. USC up 14. Good. I don't like Penn State either. Man, when I was a kid, I had to put up with Nebraska and Oklahoma just kicking the shit out of everybody in the Big 8, which became the Big 12. And uh, Alabama and Penn State kicking everybody else's ass outside of the uh, Big 8 slash Big 12. So, yeah, those old blue blood schools, I cannot stand. I will always root for them to lose. And the worst as a kid was when Penn State would play Oak or uh, Penn State would play uh, Alabama in the Sugar Bowl. It's like, oh, God. I'd still watch the game, but I didn't know who to root for to lose. <laughs> that was terrible. Good pitch, good pitch. Down four to nothing. That's not good. Already seven hits allowed. Rough start. Oh, we're just going to hook that down there. Down and just pulled that enough. It's way out in front of that changeup. I'll take the hit, though. Hits a hit. All right, Donnie, let's go. Oh, that's a strikeout. Now I can just go on contact because there's uh, two outs, two and two count. Come on, Jordan. Yeah, that's going to go nowhere. All right. Offense is lacking here at the start of the game. All right. They get a home run and we get a home run and now we're down by five. Okay. Maybe if I can do something here, we can spark the uh, simulation rally. If I read that right, it looks like Trout's got a 100-point difference against lefties and righties. There we go. That's going to be an extra base hit and a run. A single and an RBI double. There we go. Granny away from a tie game. Come on, Donovan. Can somebody please get a hit when I'm on base because this is ridiculous. All right, at least he moved me up. So now I can score on a sack fly or a ground out. All right, Walker, do not strike out. Of course he strikes out because that's what happens in the sim. None of your guys do a damn thing. <laughs> All right, Josh with the 97 clutch. Lefty, lefty here. He beat it out. There we go. All right. Back to a three-run game. And Montgomery gets his third RBI of the game. So now we're back to a four-run deficit. One out here for Trout. See if we can put one out to left field. Nope. Late. So going to put one in the bullpen here. Wind's blowing out to left. Yeah, early. 
Way early in a 93. Don't get the ball up. Just trying to fight that off. That was a terrible swing. Terrible swing. All right, back to a two-run game now. Big rally. Mason win. Time run in second. Two outs. Just a single should tie this game. Throw a strike. Nothing down and nothing down and away. I don't know if that's going to be caught. Fuck. That's going to be an L. Donovan hit a solo homer, but I blew the chance that inning right there with that AB. He pitched that bullshit game. Bybee. Bybee and Miller. Gross. All right, Painter and Kaibush lose again, four to three. We gotta quit losing two out of three here to these American League teams. Tyrone Taylor with a home run, Royce Lewis with a home run. Painter pitched okay. Barlow lost it in extra innings. Scouting, this guy's nothing special. Let's go. What do we need? How about catcher? Last week to scout those guys. We'll leave him there. See if we can discover some catchers. Catchers are outside of the guys that are generational at the top of the first round. They are damn near impossible to find a usable catcher. Oh, Reed Detmers. We are not going to bat against him because he takes forever to throw the ball. His motion is one of the most annoying ones. So we'll just sim this game and we win 9 to 2. Tink. It's another win. Gorman, home run, win, two home runs. I think 10 Ks in five innings. Kind of like that. All right. Seven game lead on the Pirates. They've gained three in the standings, so they've been hot. They were in last place at one point. There's no trade block. Pete Crow. <laughs> he just tore us up and he's on the trade block? Rip. Really? Let's go save this. Oh, man. And Diamond Dynasty has just been boring as shit because I have everything finished, everything completed, every program. Uh, at least the new Team Affinity came out like, yesterday, so I was able to get started on that. But I've collected all the stuff except for the season one, two, and three collections. So it's there's like nothing to do. And the uh, only franchise I'm doing right now is the Cardinals. All right. You know what? I'm going to start this game with Manoa because we started him opening day and he only lasted like four outs before he got hurt. So we're going to go ahead and go against Taj Bradley. Play this full game. And just because I like them so much, we're going to make them wear the City Connect. Hey, look, I said something nice about the Cubs. I think they have one of the best uh, City Connect uniforms in the game. I think the, uh, the Padres and the Red Sox have two of the worst ones. Especially the Red Sox. God, fucking ugly. And they decided to keep those for next year and get rid of the navy blue. These teams make zero sense sometimes. Absolutely no sense. All right. Those Cub Unis are beautiful. All right, here we go, boys and girls. Full game. It's like the wind's blowing straight in from center field, too. We have to play the line drive game and try not to uh, get balls up in the air too much. There we go. I'll take that. It's gonna get to it before I can get to second, though. Oh, 
Always want to keep your balls down, guys. Never want them up. All right. Donnie, let's go. Oh, that was right down the middle. I just flipped it out there. Right down the pipe. All right, Jaywalk. I haven't hit... I think I hit one. Hit one home run with him. 14 to 3. Yeah. It's going to be 30 something to 3 before too long. Walker can drive in Trout. That'll get him to 50. Oh, is that going to be down in the corner? No. Oh, it is. And he's just got to hold. I had to wait so long. To see if he was going to miss it. Oh, get out of fucking play. Get out of play. Get in stance. Nope. Wild One Grim Reaper. Hello. Welcome in. All right. Two on, two out. Ah. We are tardy today. Uh, we just traded him this year. This offseason, we traded him to the Angels in part of the deal to get uh, Trout. Traded uh, Edmund and Walker Bueller and the number one prospect in baseball to the Angels for Trout. But we had him the entire time going up to that point. And, in fact, he had a 26 home run, 100 RBI season out of the leadoff spot one of the years. He uh, started to struggle a little bit last year, so we got rid of him. There we go. We traded for a Manoa at the uh, All-Star break last year, and then we re-signed him to an extension this offseason. Traded the the first year we traded Goldschmidt and Carlson and probably a pitching prospect I think to Cleveland and we got Tanner Bybee, Josh Naylor and Nick Sandlin. So Naylor's been our first baseman since first year. We kept our uh, yeah kept Arenado every year. We let him go as a free agent this year, so we let him play out his contract. And then we traded for Royce Lewis to replace him in third. That's out of play. Change up. Come on, Donnie. Get there, get there, get there, get there on your horse. There we go. Deep in the corner. All right, Nolan. Gorman had a 51 home run season last year. Yeah, we got rid of Marmol the first year. Fuck that dude. I can't stand him. Down. Get down. Get down. Boom. There it is. Gorman's average is not good this year, but he's been doing really well for first four or five seasons in, man. He's been really good. Come on, Lars. It's got to be the shoes. You know why? If you guys want to know why I say that, there's an old Michael Jordan vi uh, video a commercial with him and Spike Lee. And Spike Lee's uh, his character in Mars. I would say in the commercial, it's got to be the shoes. So that's why I say it for Lars. Come on, Henry. Hank the Stank, you've been doing really well. You've done well when I've batted with you as well. We replaced Contreras with Davis. Davis was our backup last year, and he's moved in to be starter this year. Let's keep getting jammed. Can't make solid contact in the air. All right, Mason. He has been awesome since year two. Trying to shoot at the right. Let that go. 
He's up to 50 RBIs. He's first in the National League. All right. Our ninth place hitter leads the National League with 50 ribs. <laughs> Maybe I should bat him higher in the order, huh? Kind of wanted that uh, speed in front of Trout, but I need to move him up. There you go. Work that count. Didn't even close, Bradley. Two and two. Two outs. And he's really trying to fight that off. go chase that slider if he just wants to stand there and look at it I'll gladly pour three pitches into the strike zone I mean what am I gonna do yeah missed my spot let's throw him a change up Back with a sinker. Wasted it. High fastball. Slider down and in. We don't get it this, we'll throw a change up again. And that was way over the plate. It was too fat of a pitch. Look, it stayed in the park. At least it's two outs, so. Just take care of this next batter. We should be all right. There you go. Triantos. Start him with two sinkers. Easy ground ball. And we're out of the jam. There we go. Hey, we still know how to pitch. Even though we've been giving up way more home runs in MLB 24 than we did in 23. I've never had so much problems keeping balls in the ballpark as I have this year with this game. Ah, look at that by me. Come on. You need a high pitch. Ah. Swing at the arm and not the ball. Let's go. There we go. That's going to be a gapper. One hop off the base. Oh, I forgot. I'm so used to Diamond Dynasty R2 is the advance, and it's um, R2 is advance all bases, right? I forget that it's L1 in the franchise, so I screwed myself out of a double. Crow's got wheels. He gets to everything. All right, Jordan. Take that. Thank you. Upper half, middle in. Oh, ball two. Three. We're going to sit dead red. Middle in. And we were late. Not a good look. Sit on a pitch and then you're late. There we go. All right. Two on and one out. And this should be Naylor. Yep. It's getting 97 clutch. So this should come into play here. Oh. Just a bit early. 21 to 3. Hey, see? That game's already over. God damn. That's a ball. One ball, two 
Throw me that curveball again. Flipped it out there and then he's going nowhere. I need a clutch hit. Haven't had one yet. Come on, Royce. At least now we get an extra step on our lead. All right. That might be in the stands. Back to the track. To the wall. It's gone. Can't forget screenshots. Actually, let's get a shot like this. There we go. Ooh. Way out in front. Come on, sit. Sit back, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. That was a poor at bat, but I'll take the one from Lewis. I heat. Have a seat. Easy ground ball the third. I'll take that. Stephen Kwan. I thought about uh, signing him to play left field. Moving Donovan back to second. Changed my mind. Decided, let's go get Trout instead. Actually, I think I was going to play Quan in center because his defense is really good. He'd be your typical speedy defensive center field guy. And uh, I decided, no, I want, the, I want Trout. Make up the uh, for the mistake because the Cardinals took Shelby Miller the same first round that Trout went to the Angels and we took Miller earlier than Trout went so tried to right that wrong and get Trout into the playoffs let's go come on Lars
Damn, he's down to 273. He was hitting a 400 at one point. He's really been struggling. He's hitting 403. Mm, jammed. He's looking outside. Got me inside. All right, two and one. Still don't have to swing. Here we go. Three and one count. It's called a cripple pitch. He's got to throw it in the strike zone. And we're going to hammer the shit out of that into the gap. Is that going to be out too? Yes, it is. Into the basket. <laughs> Get up, baby. Get up. Get up. There we go. That was a line drive. That was not a towering shot. Look at that. Right into the basket. They don't have that stupid basket. That's a double. Ah. It's still early. I thought I waited enough and I was way early. Oh. Got some candy. Look at this bag. Big ass bag of Twizzlers. Ah, swung under that. How the fuck did they swing under it? go another hit for trout <laughs> we'll hold up there Pete's got a good arm All right, Jaywalk. Your turn. Yeah, play. That's going to get two runs home. Nope, just one. Donovan's not that fast. All right, they ain't five nothing, though. And he's out of here. Hey, right, who's coming in? Caleb Killian, 585 ERA, 300 average for lefties and righties. That's not a good matchup for these guys. Second and third with two outs and a guy with 97 clutch. Stayed off that. Should have stayed away from that. Let's go. Get it a little bit down. A little bit down. I'll take that out. That's where I wanted it. It's good contact. Looked like a swing outside of it. Let's move more. Target. Hmm. Cutter's getting in on me more. All right. Let's sit right in the middle of the uh, strike zone then. There we go. Two and two. <laughs> Fuck you. There's the third out.
Boom. Alright, Donnie, get there. It's really Trout's ball, but we'll let you get it. That was a middle high changeup that luckily stayed in the park. <laughs> and that was not a good pitch. Another one that just stayed in the park. Through, there we go. A couple of hits for him. Inch him up to 240. All right, Lars. Ooh, just enough to squeak it through. I thought that was going to be an easy double play. It was way out in front of that pitch. Way out in front of that pitch. All right, Hank the Stank up. Let's go, buddy. Hard to lay off that high strike. It's just too much inside. He throws me a cutter that goes back over the plate. Nope, that's flipped into center field and he's gonna catch that. All right, Mason. Double play if I swing at that pitch. Mm. Thought I waited enough. Apparently I didn't. One ball. Not, not far enough, especially at third base. off the end of the bat. It's going to get caught. <clears throat> <coughs> oh, man. Did uh, Cleveland beat Detroit today? Did Cleveland go into the uh, ALCS against the Yankees? There we go. I'm going to have to hold them. Just annoys the shit out of me that the Dodgers, the Mets, and the Yankees are all in the uh, LCS. Can't stand any of those teams. <laughs> None of them. Guess I'll be rooting for Cleveland by default because fuck the rest of those teams. Cannot root for Pond Scum. Can't root for the Dodgers and Yankees. Ever. So... Pond Scum, that's our nickname for the Mets, going back to the uh, mid-80s. Got a piece of that. Yeah. It's not a good playoffs this year. The only way it could have been okay is if the Padres had beat the Dodgers. <clears throat> then I would have rooted for the Padres to win. One, because of Mike Schilt, their manager, the Cardinals sent packing even though he got him in the playoffs every year and two they're the lesser of all evils out of all those teams <clears throat> all right three and two count everybody's running off with the pitch Oh, 
I swung a ball for a son of a bitch. That's a rope up the middle. Got him. Wish he had a cutter. We'll just live with what he's got, though. All right. <clears throat> Two outs. Just keep him in the park. Totally missed my spot. Sit down, clown. No runs through five. Come on, Jordan. Ooh. Just clipped the bottom edge. Yeah. Late decision to swing. It's a high fly ball. He's going to track that down. Wind was blowing out or no wind at all. That's a home run. Got under that one. Shit. All right. Back to the mound. Good. Get him out. Keep him off the bases. Newt, get on your horse. You got it. Ah, fuck. How did he miss that ball? Got him. He was looking outside. <laughs> he was looking for this pitch.
Got him. There we go. Through six. Come on, Nolan. Get two singles, but you haven't hit the ball hard all day. That's out of here. Adios, pelota. Oh, no. Short, and he caught it on the wall. I thought I hit that way better. So did he. Wow. Thought that was in the basket for sure. Wow. Shocking turn of events, Cotton. And it's going to get caught. All right. Hank the Stank is 0 for 3. Let's see if we can get him a hit. Don't swing over the top of sinkers. That would help. Just haven't seen the pitches very well when I've been batting with him today. And he's going to be over for 4. All right. I got 9 ounces to go, boys and girls. 9 ounces to go. Yeah, that's oh, that's with my sinker. It needs to be down, not up there. All right. Let's find the strike zone. Wow, four pitch walk. Not good. Got him. There we go. Really need a double play is what I need. Let's see if I can get this guy to hit into a double play. Almost. Swing and a miss. Sit down. I mean, is that 11 K's? Yeah. Nope. Come on, Mason. You got the wheels. All right. Six more to go. Yeah, tight spot. I don't play anybody online. And I certainly don't put on chat. <laughs> I don't want to talk to anybody when I'm playing. And with the way lag is, I just refuse to play anybody online. <clears throat> the only people you'll see me play online is when we were playing at NWO. And I'm not in that league anymore, so. It's like Jimmy got his uh, cable repairman out to get his connection fixed, so they should be back online soon. Fuck. Hey. Yeah. Just tell him to take your dick out of his mouth and see if he can speak clearly then. There we go. All right, Jaywalk, you got two hits. Get a big three-hit performance? No, that's going to get caught. He's too fast to let it drop. 
Come on, Naylor. Let's go. Josh is one for four, but it was a blast. Needs one RBI to get the 50. Mason wins at 50. <clears throat> Parker's close to 50. Nope, that's not going to do it. All right. Be nice if these guys would put a ball in play once in a while. And my guy can reach it. They always seem to hit it just out of the reach, especially the Gorman. Never fails. Just take the out at first. There we go. There we go. Got him on the changeup. Gives me 12 Ks. He's out of energy. Well, he's staying in the game until he gives up a run. I don't care. He's through eight. There we go. <clears throat> All right, Royce. You have a home run in this game. Yeah, jammed. Ali, yeah. Ali, I hate fucking Ali and Mo. Need Mo, Larry, Curly, and Ali, and everybody else in the front office to get the fuck out of here. I watched Bernie Miklas. He has a podcast on YouTube, so I watched it the other day. And uh, he's like, why should we bring in another manager like Francona just to deal with a team that's going through a, a rebuild um, when they're not ready to win? Let, let Ali manage the team next year then when chime bloom takes over full time if he wants to get rid of him get his own guy then he can do that pin everything on mo and ollie <clears throat> so i i get that sentiment <clears throat> i don't agree i think they both should have been fired last year much less this year but uh, shit they both should have been gone after last season the only reason why they made the playoffs the first year Ali was manager was because they had Yachty and Albert. And Tyler O'Neill sort of punched him right in the fucking mouth when he sold him out to the media. They knew he had a, a, a leg problem. They sent him anyway, and then they throw him under the bus to the media. And you can be critical of your players, you just don't throw them under the bus. Gorman and Walker have been regressing. True. I, I will tell you this. Um, a kid that grew up playing baseball with my son from age four all the way up through high school and college. He was drafted by the uh, Tampa Bay Rays. He's a catcher in AAA, Kenny Piper. Um, I was watching their series um, at Durham. And Walker played great. He threw two guys out on the bases. He hit a monster home run to center field. He looked comfortable. He looked great. They call him up to uh, platoon and bat against lefties, even though he has reverse splits and he does better against righties than lefties. And he gets 12 at-bats and they send him back down to the minors. The best thing for Walker is to just leave him the fuck alone and let him play. He's, he's stupid young, right? He's so young. Um... 
we, we, we don't know how to deal with hitters at the major league level. There we go, Manoa. Six hit shutout with 13 strikeouts. Yeah. Yep, so here. Ali is like 30-something years old, right? And he was a career 230 hitter in the minors, and he's trying to tell major league players how to fucking do. Just get the fuck out of here. And the bow tie uh, bucktard, he uh, he inherited a really good organization, and he's let it go to shit. He doesn't know how to sign free agents. doesn't know how to make trades. They let the minor leagues and the prospects go because they're spending. I don't know why they can't spend money on both. They have enough money to spend it on both. Why do we have to take away from one to give to the other? I don't get it. I don't get it. Let's just sim this game. Here we go. 14 to nothing. <laughs> Gorman and Win with a home run. Win with two doubles. Trout goes three for six. Donovan three for six. Gorman, five ribs. Mason Win, five RBIs batting ninth. Cutliff with a four hit shutout. So we have back to back shutouts against the Cubs. Ben Brown, Tanner Bybee. And we win 4-2. We gave up two runs that whole series. Jordan Walker and Royce Lewis with home runs. Matsui gave up two runs, but Bybee, eight shutout. Duran got the save. All right. Pirates are still eight and a half back. <clears throat> yeah, Carlson trade was, uh, they, they traded him too late. I don't know what his problem was I don't know what his problem was all right 45 wins Rays have 44 Guardians have 45 so all right here's our stats Walker 295 11 and 51 Naylor 340 12 and 49 Trout 312 15 and 33 Mason 291 with 11 and 55. Gorman, 240, 17 and 42. Royce, 242 with 12 and 35. These guys are all hitting 280, 270. Not bad. We got Sejazi as a backup player. Rangifo's a platoon. Wilson's batting 500, 15 for 30. All right. Pitching's getting better. Finally got all of our relievers under five. Barlow's the only one up. <clears throat> that whip, he had too many walks, but that's part of the deal with Duran. So at the Doyers, let's bats in this game. Player lock. And who do you want to player lock with? Um Let's go with Donnie. <clears throat> yeah, they fired Matheny. They should have hired Terry Francona instead of Matheny back in the day. <laughs> we would have won a World Series back then. We also went cheap. We could have signed um, Luis Robert. Could have signed Robert. We didn't want to spend the money. He was an international free agent. Tatis Sr., one of the Cardinals assigned Tatis Jr., and we uh, didn't want to give them half a million. <laughs> Imagine this team with Robert and Tatis. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, Skip, I don't think he would want to come back during a rebuild. I don't think that really helps him too much. I want I want somebody older that's got more experience. Ah. Joe Madden would be fine for me, but 
he probably w won't take it. He Madden was a was a, a Cardinal fan when he was younger. All right, we're losing three to four. Four to three. I do not want Descalzo. I don't want anybody that's currently in the organization. I want somebody outside. I don't think he got enough of that. We need somebody completely... We need the whole new staff outside of what we've had. Um, if they want to do uh, develop prospects and stuff, they're, they're going to the right place because the Tampa Bay model works. Imagine Tampa Bay, that they could also keep their players. <laughs> if if McClanahan comes back, gets over his Tommy John, and he gets back to his old self, and they don't want to sign him, I will take him in a heartbeat. <clears throat> two on, no, sorry, one on, two up. Dig, 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 dig. I should have moved Mookie back to the outfield. All right, tie game in the seventh. Trevor Rogers. Ball, throw, safe. There we go. Is that Trout? Yeah, it was. All right, RBI situation here with one out. Wind is blowing in briskly. I want to get line drives, but just not doing it. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know what happened with those guys. Maybe it was their approach. Maybe it was the coaching. I have no idea. I mean, they're older. They do start losing power. Um, I think Arnau's problem was he was sulking. and uh, But he could be hurt and not tell anybody. Because sometimes, you know, these guys, sometimes they have shit going on at home. They're injured and they don't want to tell you what it is. Um, there's a lot of things that go into it that we have no information on and we don't know why they're playing like shit. We're just thinking, you know, what's your problem? But, you know, sometimes they have other stuff going on and it uh, really messes them up. We we tend to forget that they're actually humans. <laughs> oh, man. All right, Tink. Tink and Stone. Where are we at? 115. Another game would be 215. <clears throat> yeah, it's Manoa. So Tink will probably pitch here, right? So Tink. Yeah, so we'll pitch with Hens there. Let's just send that game. All right, five to nothing, Tink. Yeah, we're we're uh, Tink might make the thumbnail. <clears throat> He's eight and one now. Trout with two triples and a homer. My goodness. Played Victor in right and let him off and dropped Trout in the order. That looked pretty good. Ringifo's in left. Man, that's a, that's like a typical Ali Saturday, I'm sorry, Sunday lineup. They take everybody out and play all the guys, the scrubs at the bottom of the order. And then they wonder why we don't win. Scouting. He's no good. Didn't find any catchers. I have no chance to get those guys. Let's look at him. You're picking so late. Let's look at Matsui. All right, so still trying to find catchers. <clears throat> yeah, I did give up on college football 25. I played it for three weeks. I fucking hate it. I told everybody. All summer, all all spring into summer, I'm like, the only thing that matters is gameplay. Don't listen to the, the bells and the whistles and all the pageantry and all the other bullshit that doesn't fucking matter. It's all window dressing. The gameplay. 
and the gameplay was ass. I fucking hate that game. So I uninstalled it completely. Um, I don't know. If I'm, I was bitter for a while. My wife got tired of listening to me bitch, but I'm like, you know what? I spent $100. I didn't get the game I wanted, so I'm going to bitch and get my $100 worth of bitching. <laughs> Drive everybody insane, but I have I have refrained from reinstalling multiple times just because I enjoy not uh, raging all the time. So let's see where are we at. Forty six and twenty four, eight and a half games still. Um, Shohei, Shohei, Shohei. Mm -hmm. We already did the one. Yeah, we won't. We'll just sim. And we lose five to four. Naylor with a home run. Damn, I know I didn't pitch great. Shohei he had a triple and a double. He didn't pitch that great either. Pitched okay, but not great. Milwaukee, DL Hall. That's a lefty. Man Cave. <coughs> <coughs> Yeah, man, Cave, I know. You, you've you been giving it um, a chance the whole time. And, and you know, it's good for you if you enjoy it. I mean, I watch your streams. I just can't do it. Um, I fucking hate EA so much. Um, I wish these guys would make a football game because at least they know how to make a game that plays mostly well. There is some issues with the feeling um on the human side that doesn't match up with the feeling for the cpu but you know i'm not saying if if you like the game you shouldn't play the game i just hate the game and i i just no i don't like it so deal hall let us player lock in this he's a lefty so let's Let's play with Sajacy. Let's do that. <clears throat> the uh, recruiting was completely different, and I didn't mind it, and it had some good stuff and some bad stuff. Um, and I would have gotten used to it. The good thing with the recruiting... The good thing... What's up, Batten? The good thing with the recruiting... Here, I'm going to shout out, man. Okay. Go check him out because you'll enjoy his streams. He does play couch football. Um, the thing with the recruiting is last time people weren't streaming the game, right? For the most part. Um, and because of COVID, everybody started streaming because we were home 24-7, right? And that drove a lot of interest in... Uh, new people that weren't playing the old game and younger people that play the old game and older guys like me that play the old game. And so now we have more people playing the game and we have more people trying to figure out the recruiting. That's a good thing. You, you don't need to have it, you know, be dominated by one or two people that know what, know what's going on. It, it's actually good for the community that everybody chimes in and figures it out so we can, uh, <clears throat> flatten that curve, the learning curve. I just wish the game. I just wish the. Uh, I just wish the sim part of the game was fixed. God damn it! Because uh, you can be crushing the team, and then all of a sudden you give up thirty points in the fourth quarter because the EA doesn't know how to do a perfect simulation. Fucking ridiculous! I mean, it simmed well in. NCA 14, but now this game is just fucking broke when it comes to the sim, especially. <clears throat> and I do go on uh, Couch Football 25 Reddit, so I get to see what's going on. It's not like I checked out of the uh, community altogether. 
Usually I'm reading the ones where shit's going bad and I'm just chuckling, but... Come on. Throw me a strike. Get down. There we go. <coughs> that two-out rally going. He's got nine. This is Davis. Yeah. Come on, Henry. Ninety percent of the at bats when you're running on the base paths ends up in a strikeout. It's the stupidest thing. Braylick with a home run, down two to one. Leclerc. My son missed playing in high school with Devin Williams by one year. Kenny Piper has a freshman got a hit off Devin Williams in uh, district playoffs with all the uh, MLB scouts there. <laughs> Oh, we actually had a seeing eye hit against the computer for a change. <clears throat> Come on, Henry. Find a gap. Give me the scoring position. That's yeah, a double play. Look how much the JC looks like Arenado in this game. He looks just like him. And we lose. Arise, Freilich with home runs. Lewis with a home run. Cutliff pitched well. Matsui takes the L. <clears throat> 11 strikeouts by D.L. Hall. All right. Bybee and Gasser. No, oh, 9 to 4. Not good. Three home runs allowed. JC played again, got a home run. Griff McGarry and Andrew Painter, and we win. Slugfest, 11 to 10. Arise with a home run. Walker, Gorman, and Newt Bar with home runs. Ugh, that was an ugly game. All right. 47 and 27. Only a six game lead over the Pirates. We gotta get, we gotta, we're like treading water right now. <clears throat> what have we done this month? Oh, three and three. Four. One, two, three, four. Five, three and five, four, five, six, seven and five, eight and six, nine and six. We are, yeah, we're playing 500 ball this month. All right. Tink Hintz against Tanner Houck. Houck went to Mizzou. All right, we're going to play this full game, and we're going to pitch as... Yeah, wear those. Yeah, I don't want to wear those. Let's wear our regular ones. All right. <laughs> Get that graphic off. Here he is, eight and one. 89 strikeouts and 79 innings. Of course.
Four. Six. Oh, too slow. Gorman was too slow on the uh, the turn there. Got that one, though. I'll take that. All right. <clears throat> like the City Connects? I like their City Connects. I don't like the hats. If they had put that Fleur de Lis that they have on the sleeve on the hat, that would have been good. But uh, the jerseys, I like. I learned to take some pitches, man. Fuck. <clears throat> there we go. <clears throat> Fuck. I got fall allergies, so I have some uh, sinus drainage that's just driving me insane. Actually, the hats that I like, that they, it would have been nice if they had to use those. Hold on. Let me go to my Twitter. Those, the Angry Bird. I wish they would add those as our road hats. <clears throat> oh, 76 hats. You mean the, the ones with the stripes around it? Yeah. Those. They weren't bad when we when we played and wore them. The Pirates about the only team that wore them that it really looked good. Because the Phillies had them too. The Phillies and the Cardinals. And the Pirates. Stay back. <clears throat> Lazy fly ball. Zero wind at Bush. <clears throat> I said this before. Between second and third base, if you draw a straight line between second and third on the infield, that's where that street was that used to be on the uh, south side of the stadium where they had the overpass to go where the, the buses used to park. I uh, camped out on that street right by that old overpass and got Game 7 tickets for the 82 World Series. And we watched the uh, Willie McGee two home runs, great jumping catch game on somebody's TV. That's what we did all night long. <clears throat> yeah. I slept on that street right by the uh, bridge, the, the pedestrian bridge. And then... Uh, my grandfather got me Game 6 tickets the day of Game 6. So I was there for that thing. Hernandez hit that home run over the wagon gate, and then the flood gates opened with the rain and big, long delay. I didn't even stay for the end of that game because I was in high school. But between... And that's gone. Between those two games and the parade the next day, I flunked a uh, modern novel class in high school it's my only f my dad was giving me shit about it and i'm like dude i don't give a shit that was the i had enough credits to graduate already i didn't need the class and that's the first world series since i've been uh a fan i mean they won in 67 but i was too young <clears throat> i was only two but uh that was well worth the f Come on, man. We out in front of that changeup. Let's bust him up and in. 
Man, how about a curveball? Got him. There we go. A lot of work. Way too much work. <clears throat> All right, Josh. All right, we're just dipping a little bit. Get... Every pitcher is a goalie. That's a hit. It's only a single, though. He went to Fox. Oh, he missed it. I have refed volleyball at Fox, both for club and uh, high school. <clears throat> I was just down at Mineral Area College um, yesterday for four matches. So I had to go by there. Way home, I saw they had a they had a nighttime football game going on. Here we go. That's a ribby. And an extra base hit. Yeah, I'm up north. I'm with the Hazelwood West. Con Henry. Get under it. All right, we tied the game. There we go. That's a guy that had the uh, bunt singles to start the game. <clears throat> Man, I am struggling to find my mark with him right now. There we go. A high fastball. Come back with a curveball. Of course, inside the bag. <clears throat> safe. So you're a year older than me. <laughs> ah, I threw it to the wrong bag. All right, drain another runner. Let's go. Ah, damn myself. Oh, he missed it. Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Let's 
his steal's only 48. It just means he gets a bad jump. He steals better in the sim than he does in the actual game. Come on, Trout. <clears throat> I tried to go down and hook that. Let's just try and drive this up the middle. Yeah, that was not a good at bat. Damn. Throw something straight once in a while, dude. There we go. He misses that win scores easily. All right, two on one out. Come on, Jaywalk. <clears throat> Get this ball in the air. I don't want to hit him with a dull play. Get the ball up. Just battling. <laughs> Got enough of that one. That was just elevated enough to get good wood on it. Over the bullpen. All right, Josh. Only one out. Flip that out there. Is it going to drop? No. What a catch. What a catch. We're just hacking now. Shit backed up on me. Party. <clears throat> That's all right. Jordan did what he needed to do. Bam. This is the guy that homered off us. Ivan Herrera. I forgot we traded him to Toronto. I think that was in the Manoa trade. One and one. There we go. Did not hold up. Right. 
There we go. <clears throat> Across the bottom crawl, they got what teams are looking for at the trade deadline. And right now... Ooh, throw a walk. I am not looking for anything. I do not think, unless we have a major injury, I don't think we're going to uh, make a deal at the deadline. If we lose somebody um, big in an injury, then I will look into it. Because we, we are World Series or bust. This is our last year playing with the Cardinals. We've won 100 games three years in a row. 90 games the first year. And uh, we lost in the World Series to the Rangers last year. Because this game is not fair on defense at all. <clears throat> Rockies are tied with the Dodgers for the lead in the National League West. Amazing. It's not me building him up either. Hmm. That was a nasty sinker. Looked like it was going to be here and ended up over there. Almost worked like a two seam. <clears throat> there we go. Go to third. Go to third. All right. Minute at the corners. Only one out. Fly ball should give us another run. Come on, Mason. You're the dude. That sinker is filthy. One ball, two strikes. Strikeout's better than double play. We have Trout on deck. It's one reason why Bat and Trout lead off is so we have that power when we roll back around to the top of the order. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. <clears throat> Gorman would have been out by 10 feet. That'll get the run home. There we go. Four run lead. All right, Trout. Uh oh. Is that going to be enough? No, nope. I don't think so. It is! Wow! That was a weird track that he took to go back on that ball, and somehow it just gets over the uh, the flowers. All right. <laughs> I'll take it. Looked like it was going to be caught on the warning track, and it just kept going. There's no wind blowing out. Look at this center fielder's route. I'm just going to let this play out. I felt like I hit a good... Ooh, that was off the label. That should have broke the bat and everything. Watch the center fielder's route. He's running sideways. Oh, he's going to catch that. Oh, and then he takes off and runs backwards and runs out of room. Wow. We're in get the game over with mode. <clears throat> A bunch of base runners to start the game, and we've settled down since then. It's out of play. We're out Royce right now. Throw him out. Took too long to stop his momentum. Buck just slide on an E and pop and throw.
Got him on the change up. There we go. Need to try to backdoor him. I don't think he's going to get that. I think it's going to be off the fence. Yep. Right down the pipe. Fuck. <clears throat> that was a long home run. All, <clears throat> All right. All their runs on two home runs. I was right down the pipe, and he didn't miss. All right, Jordan, we're only got a four-run lead now. Ball one, no strike. Got hundred. Sawinski has nineteen home runs, really. All right, Josh. Oh, that pitch is out. Two one. Dropped the bad head, but that was way out in front. That's a gapper. That's at least two, maybe three. <clears throat> If that was win, it would be three. Hey. Try to golf that. Just kept riding in. All right. Tink has got about one long inning, two short innings away. He should be able to get through seven. Depends on how many pitches we got to throw. That changeup just won't stay down. Got him. What a pitch. <clears throat> Trying to get a chase, he wouldn't go for it. All right, he's through six. Should be able to get one more inning out of him. Let's go, Newt. Ah, way out in front of that changeup. That was a fun. <laughs> Looked great, but there was no no speed to it at all. He doubles up. I don't see too many double up changeups. Two 
That was just a uh, really bad at bat. Go get through. Let's go with that pitch and shoot it in the right. Bring up Mason Win. See if we can do some real damage with Mason now. <clears throat> nope, that's double play. All right, nine outs to go. Should be his last inning. Unless we're going to get a bunch of uh, low pitch at bats, then he might go in eighth. Two down. Where are we at pitch wise? He's at 79. Might be able to start the eighth. Hung that. <laughs> that was not a good pitch. He's tired. This will be seven strong innings. We can take him out. <clears throat> See if we can extend this lead, make it a little more comfortable. <clears throat> Trout with a two-run homer. Unexpected two-run homer. Should be able to track that down. Yep. Didn't hit real hard. <clears throat> RJ walk. Went deep earlier. Played out the center twice and homered the left center. And it's gonna be a fly out to left. <clears throat> All right, six outs. Let's bring in Mason. Now, number 19,
Big guy out of first. Make sure we get one. <clears throat> He's going to throw a bunch of pitches this inning, so we'll bring in somebody else for the nine. There we go. All right. <clears throat> we got to get a uh, picture of Hints before we exit out of this game. In fact, we're going to do it right now, so I don't. Not the previous play. One ball, two strikes. Swung under it. Well, that's not a good look. Come on, Nolan. You're due. About time we get one of those. Hit the ball up the middle all the time. Their pitcher snags it. <clears throat> Every time they hit us to hit it to us, it either smacks off our head and knocks us out of the game or goes right between the wickets to the outfield. Nope. Ooh, just missed. And that should do it. Gave up seven hits, two home runs, 
we pounded Hauk. Everybody but Naylor and Gorman had hits. Walker and Trout with home runs. Strong seven by Tink, up to nine wins. <coughs> see if he can get his 10th in the uh, simulation here. All right. Manoa against Barrios. And we got the win. Six to one. Taylor Trammell, homers again. That's our only run. No home runs for us. Manoa pitched great. Bullpen did their job. There we go. All right. Scouting again. He's the number two prospect. Looking at those guys because we'll never get to them. He's 21st. Let's finish him off. Nope, he's nothing special. So, KC95, yeah. Um, let's see. Let's see this. We'll go field international. Christian Bush. Robert Matsui. There. Save. <clears throat> All right. Chris Cutliff and Ricky Teeterman. Come on, Chris. This was our Cutliff was our uh, first first round pick of the uh, entire series. And. Uh, did not win rookie of the year, but he pitched well his first year. He's pitching well this year. He's limiting his home runs. That really helps. <clears throat> we drafted this guy last year. We drafted this guy as well. Kind of looks like Donovan. And here's another draft pick. <clears throat> and another draft pick. <clears throat> All right, Sim. Seven to one win. Francis Pratt, he was a draft pick the first year. Man, we pounded their starters for five or six runs every single time. Walker, Lewis, and Sajasi with home runs. Cutliff is eight and two. All right. Well, <laughs> second. I want to see if I have a picture of Cutlet. No, not on there. So what I'll have to do is I'm, I won't play this game on the first. I won't play the game on the first, but when we're done, I'll like load into the game and uh, get to cut lift so I can get a screen cap and then exit out so it doesn't save. <clears throat> All right, Gasser. He's a lefty, isn't he? Let's go with Let's go with Henry. <clears throat> so they have a rise playing second base. Everybody else is pretty much Milwaukee players.
Game tied at one here in the third. Set up over the middle now instead of out in the outer half. <clears throat> two and two. Also, when I was growing up, I used to listen to KSLQ. I don't even remember, don't even remember what number they were, but remember. KSLQ. All right. Bases loaded, two outs, tie game. There's a shot that's going to score two. And we're in with a double. Oh, bullshit. No way. All right. And it's a tie game. Just yell at Chomer. <clears throat> Jammed. Jammed myself being late. Two and two count. Should have painted me. Trout's on deck. Oh, so far out in front. Ooh, thought I missed that. Keep battling. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I can leave one over the plate as a mistake. Let's see if we can hit our 10th home run. Ugh. Ninety-nine right down the middle and we missed it. Alright, well, Naylor with an RBI, Gorman with a home run, Donovan with an RBI, four run lead, and we're swinging at the first pitch. Base is loaded again. We drove in two last time. Trout had four hits. Mike Trout hit for the cycle, boys and girls. He's got a double, a triple, and a home run with four hits. Trout hits for the cycle. <laughs> How about that? Let me see the replay because it was simmed. Trout hit for the cycle. Wow. <clears throat> That's too bad we didn't get to see it. All right, fifty one and twenty seven. Seven game lead over the Pirates. Best record in baseball. Walker down to 288 with 14 and 60. Trout 317 with 18 and 39. His RBIs are going to be down because he's batting leadoff. Naylor, Mason Wynn. 
Gorman, Royce Lewis suddenly up to 16 home runs. My goodness. Cutliff, 8 and 2. Tink, 9 and 1. All right, if you weren't here previously, this is what we've done. First year, we won 90 games, won the division, lost in a DS. Win 101 games, lose in a DS. Win 102 games, lose in the LCS. Win 100 games, lost in the World Series to Texas in four, I'm sorry, in six. Not four, we lost in six. Oh, Griffin Gary, we're just going to send that. I mean, lose four to one. Gainer, it's going to over five. Brady Singers with the Brewers against Tink. Simmet, and we win five to three. Trout and Mason win with home runs. Tink does not get the win. Duran's got 21 saves, though. All right, Manoa and Cabrera. So we're not going to finish that series off. And where are we at? Two hours. I will, I will player lock on somebody that one. <clears throat> um, let's see. Cabrera's right-handed, so let's go. Let's go with Lars. You know what? I might go ahead and finish this series. So that we're not stuck in the middle of a series to start the next stream. Because um, the next stream is going to be a busy one. We've got the draft. We've got probably the home run derby. And then we get the trade deadline. Maybe I'll... Uh, Player lock and pitch with cut left and don't bat. There you go. Hook that in the corner. Come on, Mason. <clears throat> All right. Trout is up. Let's see if he can deliver this run, get us the lead. Nope. Lazy fly ball. Down one nothing. Nobody on. Ah, jam. Late swing, jam myself. And now we're down three nothing in the eighth. He's dominating. We had two hits. Not good. Ah, swung over that change up. Jeez, that was quick. Bullpen. I know it pitched great. Bullpen did nothing well. Offense didn't do anything either. <laughs> it's kind of hard to win when you don't score a run, right?
All right, this is cut left. So I will player lock and pitch. We'll finish off this series since we have a busy month coming up. And uh, ooh, we have Trout going back to LA at the very on the trade deadline, no less. Well, we know we're going to play that game. So we'll probably play a game against the Pirates and then a game against, right, this game against the Angels. And then we have the draft on that date, home run derby, and trade deadline. Trade deadline probably won't be very busy for us if we don't have any injuries. I think the team's pretty, pretty well loaded, so. All right. Let me player lock on Cutliff. Now let me get a, a picture of him so I can put Cutliff and Tink on there. These are our two youngest pitchers, and they're pitching great. Let those guys have the cover. <clears throat> Get there. There we go. Oh, shot on Miami. <clears throat> Got him. Here we go. One nothing lead. Mason wins solo homer. And that's roped into the corner. Well, they won't be throwing a no hitter today. Shit, I'm not even gonna get a shutout at this rate. Two pitches. Game tied. Freaking Trout had to run to Fort Lauderdale to catch that ball. There we go. Pitch out of that jam. Limit to one. <clears throat> he went.
should be able to track that down. There we go. It would be nice if we could get a few one or two pitch outs instead of having to throw six pitches every fucking time they come to the plate. Didn't even give me a chance to field that one. Come on. I hate getting penalized for making a good pitch. Had one, one, two, three inning the whole game. First inning. Or otherwise, first pitch for a hit. Innings two, three, and four. Got one out at least. Oh, it. Sit the fuck down. Trying to get a thumbnail ready.
The only thing I can do is pitch in this game. <clears throat> God damn. At least we're holding the singles, but this is ridiculous. Every damn inning. <laughs> Change up curveball slider. Didn't throw him one fastball. Throw him out. He could have got back to the bag. He didn't need to just stand there and watch. All right. Six innings of one run. Come on, offense. Get your shit going. There, get there. Thank you. All right, he's probably done. Yep, in comes Barlow. And we lose two to one. Fuck. What happened to our offense? Ten strikeouts, seven innings, doesn't get the win. First dad with a home run. Duvall, 26 saves. He pitched for us at the end of the year last year. We didn't bring him back. Let's look at our last scouting. He's terrible. Well, there's a second baseman. Yeah, Carlos Rosado. Well, we're going to change him. Scout that second baseman. And the guy's not too bad at all.
Hmm. Let's, uh, he could be a first round pick. Let's check him out. <clears throat> Where are we at standings wise? Five game lead. The Pirates just won't go away. Thought we were going to run away with it. Look at it. Pirates, Brewers, and Cubs are all at the top of the wild card. <laughs> 50 wins, 52 wins. We have 52. Gardens have played three more games than us, so. Stats. Walker's closing in on 100 hits. So is Trout. So is Naylor. <clears throat> we just crossed over the halfway point. So that'd be 130. It says 104 and 60. That's 64 games. So let's chop it off and say 102, 102 and 60. So that's the pace we're on. Who's on the trade block? Yeah, there's not a lot of pitching. Yeah, there's really nothing I'm interested in. So let's go look at the stats for the rest of our guys. Let's go to AAA. Sheldon Parks, we drafted him early on. He's not doing bad. He's got 20 steals. Elijah Green, we traded with uh, Washington, got him. He's just wasting away. Cologne was that first-round pick that we took that the game stole away, and we had to get him back the next year. All ERAs in the four. Dice K Yoshida with 44 clutches and an ERA under one. <laughs> and this guy, 079. Dice K Tanaka, not bad. Crespo. So we got some guys down at double A that are pitching well. Cabrera, that first baseman, he's got 23 steals, hitting 355. Wow. It's only 20. His team doesn't have a whole lot of prospects on the hit side that are down. They're all up in the major leagues, so. All right. Well, boys and girls, I think that's it for the day. We're done in two and a half hours, so we're done before Oregon... Takes on Ohio State. All right. Well, I will not stream tomorrow. It's time to uh, watch NFL and my fantasy team. Um, I ref Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday this week. I have three high school and one college assignments. My college one is Wednesday, and it's like noon. It's in the middle of the day. It's really weird. So I will not stream the next three days, but I'll be back um, Wednesday night, we're moving streams to nighttime. It's much easier. Um, probably, I don't know, eight, nine o'clock central. Um, so we'll stream Wednesday and then there's a good chance I'll stream either Friday or Saturday night. Um, I think we have a, uh, chili cook off Friday, Saturday night to go to. Normally I would enter, but, uh, I decided to cut them some slack and not not give them chili that has uh, cayenne pepper and uh, jalapenos cooked in. <laughs> so, um, so that'll do Wednesday. We'll do the draft and home run derby because I'm sure somebody's going to be in it from our team. <clears throat> um, and the trade deadline, we'll play the game at the Angels for Trout's first game back. Um, we'll do a game against the Pirates because that's a big series. And then, uh, so that'll get us through July. So then either Friday or Saturday night, that would get us through August. So that means the following week, um, we could get through September and start the playoffs. Remember in the playoffs, 
we play every single game for the entire round and we do it on camera all at one time so we get to a best of seven we might have a seven game stream so <laughs> stock up anyway who is on 49er george is on i have not gotten to raid george in forever so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna go see my buddy 49er george the pimp himself let me get that raid going boys and girls We're going to start that raid. So when you guys are ready, we're going to head over and see George. Make sure you tell Jorge hi. He's a really good dude. If it wasn't for George, I wouldn't be streaming, man, at all. I'm serious. So let's go see George. You guys have a good rest of the weekend, and I'll see you on Wednesday night. And uh, you take care, and uh, I'll catch you later on. Mm -hmm.